Hi Brent, and part of our regular updates, I wanted to talk to you about some of the things that you can do to improve the reliability and reduce your maintenance costs on your Subaru. In fact, some of these components I'm gonna talk about now, you can actually use on just about any car. And in particular, we're talking about the features and strengths of magnetic sump plugs, and also the variation in the quality of oil filters. And in particular, what we've got in front of me here is our project engine out of the um, STI Whiteline MY15 16 uh, STI and this particular car has been maintained by us for quite some time it's got about 50,000 k's and you'll see it's got an STI oil filter now you gotta remember the engine is upside down so this is the exhaust manifold that comes out of the heads the oil filter the oil cooler which is factory fitted which is a heat exchanger for the oil to the radiator for the water the sump and the magnetic sump plug that we fitted so STI oil filters are quite um, popular if you know that they're available. We can actually get a similar filter now for the FA series engines. And we wanted to talk about what the difference is. Now, there is a big difference between a non-genuine uh, aftermarket oil filter for the EJ series. Then there is the factory standard WRX type filter that actually comes standard on the WRX and the STI. Then you've got the higher level specification STI oil filter. Now, there's not that much difference between the WRX one and the STI one as far as cost, but there's a huge benefit when it comes to the quality. And this is a cutaway. You can see the details of what you can get just inside an STI oil filter with the, um, the gauze that supports the outer main filter assembly. And then of course, the top and bottom assembly, which controls the oil pressure relief valve that operates inside the filter as well. Now, these are the things that are designed into a filter that then affects the operating conditions of the actual engine itself. And a lot of people don't realize the difference in quality between a high performance SDI filter, a WRX oil filter, or a cheapy five or $10 filter from another unknown brand. But when you're considering the value of these types of components compared to the, the repair costs, if something goes wrong, I highly encourage these types of parts when you're servicing your car. Um, we highly recommend and we do a lot of uh, recommendations when we just do a normal oil change. So that's one thing to think about. The other thing I want to think about, you'll notice this engine, since we've been looking after it with white line, has got a greedy magnetic sump plug and inside there looks like that. Um, it's a really highly powerful, near mid, mid, it's really hard to pronounce, magnet that when it's um, screwed in, this part of the magnet is exposed to the oil sitting in the sump. And typically, depending on what your wear and tear on your engine is, it may come out actually looking like that. Now, what you can see on the end there is actually all lots of little bits of metallic particles, which looks like fur. And if I grab a little bit, it's actually gritty magnetic wear and tear parts out of the engine that are in suspension in the oil when the engine is operating. But because of the magnetic sump plug, as the oil settles or it's circulated through the engine, it's attracted to the magnet. Then of course, when you do an oil change, you drain the oil, you pull it out, you wipe it, you put it back together so it's nice and clean. Um, the uh, Gretty sump plugs have got a reusable non-crush type washer, and then it all goes back together. Now it's also, they come with a, a hole pre-drill for if you want to tie wire it, which is another small thing, which is a feature. Now be really careful with the quality of magnetic sump plugs. We've been using the Gretty ones for a long time and we sell a lot of them. And um, we see some other cars come in with uh, unbranded or unknown brand magnetic sump plugs. And unfortunately what can sometimes happen is you go to undo them and you actually, because they're aluminium, you basically shear the hex off the threaded part and you end up with a thread stuck in the sump because the quality of the aluminium or the component is not as good as what it needs to be. So be careful what brand you choose. Um, the Greddy ones are certainly one that we recommend. And when you take, consider the cost of a magnetic sump plug for the wear and tear of your engine, I think it's a great value to consider. So there you have a couple of small things that we talk about in uh, maintaining your Subaru engine, but you can also use this on just about any other engine. Remembering different model cars use different diameter, different pitch threads, but uh, Greedy offer a pretty wide range of those as well. And we offer them for sale off our website, but we carry them in stock. So uh, for more tips and traps on how to look after your Subaru, check us and follow us on Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. Make a comment on the bottom of this channel. We'd love to hear from you. But for now, I'm Brett Middleton. Thanks for watching.